Okay. This one's a boring one, but we're going to try and make this one look a treat as well. This one's probably going to curl. The paper is probably going to curl, so I thought thought I'd let you give you guys a curl alert. <laughs> curl alert. <laughs> Oh dear. Well, maybe not. It depends on how we do it. I was thinking we're going to work in negative positive, but if we're working in positive, this actual original doesn't have uh, much toner, much coverage, so therefore hopefully the toner use won't be too much. We won't end up with lots of toner, and therefore we won't have that much issue with curling. But of course, you can't always avoid that because <laughs> a lot of images look good when they're full of toner. You know, that's what a lot of copier configuration art does use, is usually very hungry with the toner. It's not something you can do always on a low amount of toner. So I wonder if we're going to add some more hue to this. Just going to warm it up most of the way, but not all the way. Uh, but basically, yeah, a lot of it involves huge coverage of toner on the image and it gets really curly when that happens often anyway we've got here a Domino's pizza New Yorker I don't like Domino's I don't like the taste of it I find the I, I don't know if it's still the same as as it is as it is now but this one's shit a bit wider than an A4 so we're going to reduce it I'm going to reduce it or we're just going to we're going to reduce it slightly. I wonder how big we're going to make it. So, <sighs> going to reduce it. Maybe. No, we're not going to enlarge it. We're going to reduce it. So, we're going to reduce it to 86.6 for a change. So, that should be about a B4, whatever. I don't know. Fuck. But yeah, I don't like Domino's and I still prefer the good old Pizza Hut. I find Pizza Hut's really tasty. Uh, it's more expensive than Domino's, but I'm but it, but when I don't like it, I still find I don't like the Pizza Hut when it's when it's not fresh. Um, I like it fresh, so let me clarify: it's not just got to be Pizza Hut. I like to have it fresh as well. And but basically, Domino's. I tried Domino's and it tasted like shit. And I just, I, you just can't convince me to to eat Domino's. It just, it's just something I just have never liked. Uh, I don't think I'm ever going to like it. <laughs> it's basically not my taste. I think it's because it's cheap. They use cheap um, toppings and shit. And the cheese is really revolting. Like it tasted really like an, a bland sort of a sickly taste is how I describe the taste of Domino's that I, I tasted. And I just didn't like it. So now I think that looks good. And at least we do have a bit of a picture of them. There's the pizza there and the pizza up there. So we're going to do a, a, a mirror image job on this. So we're just going to get rid of this. So that's our original. Throw it away. We're going to just put that one aside. And we're just going to take this one and make it our master copy for the mirror image. But basically I just hate Domino's. And I don't know if they actually use plastic cheese as their cheese topping. Or if they use a really crude version of uh, mozzarella, but I don't, I just can't get myself to eat it. The first experience when it was new back in the 90s is just, has just not been forgotten, and I just can't, for the life of me, make myself eat Domino's. I'm pretty sure it would taste much the same as it did. It could even be worse now. Uh, but Domino's was really, is really cheap <laughs> compared with. Uh, the likes of Pizza Hut. So, and a lot of people love, a lot of people don't notice the, the disgusting yuckiness of Domino's. They seem to like, they seem to just like it because it's a good cheap meal. It is cheap. But if you don't like, if you can't palate it, what's the point in paying money for it? You're just going to feel sick. <laughs> it's going to make you gag or something, you know. And I just can't eat the shit. I just can't bring myself to eat it. After the experience I had when I first tried it. But it's going strong. I'll tell you, there's lots of Domino's in Sydney. Lots of places where you can eat Domino's. Oh, that, that pizza does look really nice and colourful now. It's really colourful. I really like that. 
that's the only part I like about the dominoes here is I'm making a demo with it <laughs> and it looks like we're making a good demo of it too I'm hoping I'm hoping the papers won't curl too much as we lay them out but yeah dominoes <laughs> not my kind of uh, eating experience but I'm happy with the color of the pizza on this demo even though it looks disgusting it's disgusting as something to eat so we're just going to take our second image and lay it out looks like the curling isn't happening in the center which is really good which means that it's not as bad now we're just going to go we're going to hit off two copies of this same image in mirror image mode to make this a complete four piece demo so we're just hitting it there close and we're just going to bring up our soft keypad and we're going to hit two copies into that so we're just going to go through the annoying photocopy process that Conigam and Alter has created yeah and print it out so let's see how we go so we've got one and we got two, two, do, two dominoes reversals. So this is the back to front version or the mirror image. So we've got two mirror images here and here. And we're just going to slot them into the overall design. We're just going to gently slot them together. Hopefully I can get these to line up beautifully. I often can't line things up terribly well, because, especially because of the curling. That tends to happen here. I think the weather has made it worse but anyway I think we've done a good job there and you can see that's Domino's Pizza reimagined